improved quite a bit over the last couple of hours. We had those thunderstorms across the upstate, and now they have moved toward the south. Some cooler, less humid air is going to slowly make its way into the area. Tomorrow, we'll feel a little bit of it, but I think Wednesday and Thursday will be your nicest days. But right now, storms have even fallen apart south of Columbia, so we're looking good across uh, western Carolinas and northeast Georgia. Tonight, 68 degrees, still feeling a little bit muggy, even though those levels will be coming down, um, and it should feel pretty nice, especially by tomorrow night. In the mountains, low 60s, no rain expected, and we'll have mostly clear skies. You should wake up to a good bit of sunshine tomorrow morning. A great day to head to the pool, and you may really need it in the upstate as temperatures will still climb into the upper 80s. And the other good piece of news, you don't have to worry so much about a pop-up storm. I feel like that was an issue really for the last several days for anyone having to go to the pool. you got to watch to see if the skies are going to darken or if you hear that thunder. Uh, but luckily, tomorrow should be a pretty worry-free day when it comes to thunderstorms. I mentioned the humidity levels. We're going to be kind of in the middle of the scale as dew points will be dropping down into the 50s by late tomorrow. That's a crisp feel. We've been in the 70s. Steamy, tropical feel. The higher that number goes, the worse it is outside. The worse hair days, too. I think maybe your hair will be a little more cooperative as you go into uh, the day on Tuesday, Wednesday, and even Thursday. Should be pretty good. Temperatures will be slightly below normal for this time of year, but rebound back to above average to near 90 by Friday. And another hot weekend is coming, too. And we'll have a chance for a few showers and storms by late in the weekend. High temperatures today topped out in the low 90s, so it's certainly uh, not anything too uncommon lately, uh, but we'll see that return by Friday into Saturday. So here's a look at the tropics. We've got a 70% chance that this unorganized area of storm activity could, can organize into potentially a tropical system, but it's probably not going to happen for two to three days. It's going to be a little while for this thing to get going, but once it does, it's going to likely move toward the north. Some models taking it more toward Galveston, Houston, others taking it along the Louisiana shore. Or either way, they tend to hook it toward the east and eventually into our area. I want to show you one of the latest computer models in a second, but I mentioned Tropical Storm Bill. It is a named storm now. It's off the coast of the Carolinas, well off the coast now. In fact, it was a little closer earlier, but it's now moved off. And it's not going to be an issue. But as for what could be Claudette as we head into later on this week, there's Friday, still in the middle of the Gulf of Mexico, but would be approaching Louisiana, possibly making a landfall as we head toward 8 a.m. Saturday morning. And then what happens is it gets drawn up by a cold front that will be coming down from the north, kind of like a magnet, helping to pull it our direction. So we'll begin to see some showers as early as Sunday, but the heaviest rain is expected on Monday. That's what most of the models show. But again, keep in mind that's a week from today and we have a while to watch this. Things can change, but there's certainly a decent chance we could see some widespread rain and it would help the South Carolina drought. Our particular area not in drought, but uh, central and eastern part of the state really need that rain um, and it would be a good thing. Uh, but no guarantees at this point. Just going about a 40 to 50 percent chance of rain late in the weekend and into early next week. Until then, nice and dry, and it will feel pretty good. In fact, lows getting down to the 50s in the mountains by Wednesday and Thursday night. Of course.